This summer, you will have the opportunity to experience an all-new multi-sensory immersive art exhibit featuring the famed works of impressionist Claude Monet. And it's just a short drive away in Indianapolis. And here to help us get out of town is the Deputy Director for Marketing and External Affairs with the Indianapolis Museum of Art at Newfields, Jonathan Berger. Jonathan, thank you for being with us this afternoon. Thank you for having me. Let's talk about the loom, first of all, because this is a great little space you've got there in the new fields. Well, you said little space, and I, I think that, you know, the thing about it is it's a big space. It's over 30,000 square feet of projection space on our entire fourth floor of our museum. And it has um, lots of exhibits. Tell me a little bit. Um, kind of, it's got a 139-year history, so I can only imagine the exhibits that have come through your doors. Oh, absolutely. We have an amazing encyclopedic collection. And so when we introduce the loom, uh, you know, we want to uh, introduce people to art and take them in a, in a bit of a deeper dive into our collection and some really great artists. And you really want to um, let your visitors immerse themselves in these um, art exhibits. I know in the past we did um, uh, Van Gogh, yes? Correct. Correct. Last year we did Van Gogh, and the loom is a is a permanent experience in our in our museum. So each year we've we've decided to explore different artists as uh, as we go through. So last year we did Van Gogh, and this year you know taking that deeper dive into Claude Monet and the whole impressionist movement. Why Monet? But you know it's a great question. I think that. Um, Newfields is the best place to host Monet because, you know, Monet and the whole Impressionist movement was all about getting outside and that end plain air style of painting and uh, Impressionism. So you have these, these great colors uh, and being outside and, and flowers and nature. And Newfield sits on 152 acres of art and nature space. So everything that we're doing in the loom upstairs, we're also doing with our horticulture team outside in our in our garden. So uh, you know, when it comes to art and nature and great experiences with art and nature, Newfields is really the place. And Monet is a great example of that. Yes, absolutely. Okay, let's talk about some of the legendary artworks that people may experience. And and we're talking a 360 degree immersive experience at that. Absolutely. So when you walk in the museum, you know, a lot of people just as they step into that threshold of, uh, of the loom, uh, they're, they're overwhelmed with the size and the magnitude. And so you're going to see uh, a lot of water lilies, uh, a woman with parasol, and all of these great paintings from, from Monet, Pissarro, um, uh, Degas. And so you're going to see all of these great things as you tour around. It, it will tell that story of that uh, Impressionist movement. We also, in that space, have a cafe where you can enjoy a, uh, a French gimlet, if you'd like, uh, and some other uh, French-inspired uh, uh, cocktails and food. And then the final gallery is um, is literally a gallery where it shows some of the work of, works of art that we have in our own collection, including including Monet. Okay, and then the music is also going to help tell the story as well. You've got a choreographed soundtrack, I hear. A uh, choreographed soundtrack that uh, with Van Gogh, we found out that a lot of people really enjoyed that soundtrack. And so we also have that on Spotify where you can go on Spotify and, and uh, listen to that soundtrack after you visit the museum. Yeah, very cool. And then you can Monet yourself. You've got a photo booth also um, there for people to... to um, Social media, everything, you know, got to, if you, if you didn't right. take a picture, you weren't there. <laughs> It was one of the most popular things with Van Gogh, Van Gogh yourself, and so we decided to bring it back. It's just one of those experiences that once people start doing it, you start to see it on social media, it starts popping up, and then everybody's, uh, uh, you know, everybody's, you know, profile picture is Monet or Van Gogh. Well, yeah, and then that creates that FOMO. You don't want to miss out on anything happening exactly. there at the Loom. All right, it all kicks off, open to the public July 3rd. I know members um, can, can go a day earlier. But let's kind of talk how this um, exhibit is going to run. 
So this will run also for a full year, just like, um, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, 11 months. You know, we do need to take a break for a month to, to, to swap it out. Uh, so this will run up until the end of May next year. Okay, and you are right there um, off North Michigan Road in Indianapolis. There's all the ticket information and address that we will have up on our website after today's show. And we sure do appreciate you um, being with us, Jonathan, this afternoon and telling us everything we need to go and experience there in Indianapolis. Well, thank you very much. You're welcome. We'll connect everyone at CILiving.tv.